I thought I was getting more sleep than I was. The thing that surprises me is um, how many steps you take every day. From the amount of sleep you get to the steps you take, some say this little device is like having a personal trainer with you 24 hours a day. It's a product called Body Media Fit, and it's designed to monitor your body day and night. And what you learn from it is supposed to make it easier to shed pounds and manage your life. Several brave staff members here at CARE gave it a try, and Belinda was one of them. Yes, there were five of us, and I actually saw this around Halloween. Chris Freitag, of course, is a fitness expert that we have on mm -hmm. CARE 11 all the time, and she had this on during a workout around Halloween. I started asking some questions, and I thought it would be really interesting to find out if regular Joes could wear it, not just fitness experts, and what could we find out from this? So we put it to the test. In fact, Jeff Olson put it to the test in CARE 11's uh, Tonight's Extra. To say that Chris Freitag sleeps, eats, and breathes fitness burning up those calories is true now more than ever. This thing has motivated me. Thanks to this high-tech item on her left tricep that's monitoring Chris's every move. It gives you the exact feedback that you need to evaluate your lifestyle and make easy, doable changes. The device has four sensors that measure things like body motion, temperature, and heat flux to calculate sleep efficiency, steps taken, and calories burned. I thought, wow, wouldn't that be interesting to get a, a group of people and see what we're all doing? Just so that it's comfortable. Bell's idea has turned into our care experiment. And there you go, you can't even tell, you know. In late January, five of our coworkers strap on bands. It gives you feedback, too. It's like your personal trainer coming back, like, good job. Chris shows them how data collected is downloaded to an online activity manager and before long they're getting a whole new look at their lives. As a person who likes to work out it was actually interesting to see actually how many calories I was burning uh, per day. <laughs> Meteorologist Jared Sebesta's armband shows he burns an average of 4,200 calories a day. My height was around 5,900 one day where I went and played basketball twice. Cheerios. If you take time to enter what you're eating the system also compares calories coming like in with those going out. For people who are trying to lose weight, this part is critical. I was not aware of what calories go into everything. Turns out a lot of us are just like accountant Jill Triple. There's actually a huge number of people who underestimate their calorie intake. Angie that Moding is a clinical dietitian with wow. Fairview Health Services. They've gotten completely distorted our portion sizes, even fruit. I mean a, a regular size small piece a fruit is normally 60 calories, but now our apples are giant. So that might be two or two and a half fruit servings. Logging my calories, I think, really made a difference. So much of a difference that Jill's already been able to put six pounds in the loss column. And decide what your goals are. Even Chris has found new knowledge in her numbers. I was sitting all the time. Sitting, not burning calories. So she's ditched her desk in favor of a standing workstation. Talk about an aha moment. It's burning an extra 300 plus calories a day for me, and that's money. I live in Andover. After an hour behind the wheel, administrator Nancy Ringstead used to have a day behind the desk. But now... It's kick-started me. She's stepping out for lunch. Yesterday, I hit 15,983, which was awesome. A full 5,000 steps over the day's goal. I am loving the information. In our experiment... So I just wasn't very active. and It seems the more time, they know... And then I went on a walk. The more or they want to go. If in the afternoon I just take 30 minutes, 4,000 steps helps everything. Their days are filled with new data, but the nights shocking are prompting the biggest surprise. Hello, you are not sleeping enough. The armband sensors measure when you're lying down and when you're sleeping. The longer the black bar, the better or more efficient your rest. There's a couple of nights where it, you know, it looked like a barcode. <laughs> it's okay. Meet Beckham Sebesta, the night owl who's doing a number on daddy's data. So I was actually laying down for nine and a half hours and I was only sleeping for, you know, six hours and 50 minutes of that. And it was all broken, you know, sleep, which is not my style. We're a sleep deprived nation. Dr. Michael Schmitz is a sleep psychologist at Alina's Abbott Northwestern Hospital. Insufficient sleep can actually affect glucose metabolism and regulation, and this can then also affect our ability to manage and maintain weight. Dr. Schmidt says some of us can get by with five hours, but... Most of us uh, fall within that uh, seven or eight hour range. I found out I'm probably averaging about four hours of sleep a night. For Kim Inslee, who comes to work by moonlight to be ready for CARE 11 sunrise... Good morning. There is some good news. 
my sleep quality when I am sleeping is sometimes better than I think it is. So that's good. I'm Kim Inslee. It's great to have you with us. John. And an afternoon nap helps too. But it's still less I'm a good sleeper. than the shut-eye being logged by Belinda Jensen. Solid. <laughs> I'm just dead to the world. Dead to the world and burning calories. I love knowing that I'm burning 500 calories during sleeping. For me, since I'm going to bed late with the news, that seven and a half hours is so beneficial for me in so many ways, and this is proving it to me. And that, Chris says, is the beauty of this technology. Well, it takes the guesswork out of your metabolism. Offering individual information to help you sleep, eat, and exercise your way <laughs> to a healthier life. The more you know about the way you live your life, about food, activity, and sleep, the better you can take care of yourself. For the CARE 11 News Extra, it's a wrap. I'm Jeff Olson. <laughs> well, a couple members of our staff did have issues getting their accounts set up at the beginning, but once up and running, we all found that the bands and their batteries were very reliable. In the end, Kim, Nancy, and Jill all lost weight, and the cost of the armbands varies depending on where you get them. We did find them at Costco for $150. There was a promotion right now that actually includes the band and the subscription that you also need. We have more information on this story on care11.com. Just click on to extras. Also, we should mention that Care did not purchase these bands. They did give us five used bands that we've been using and most of the folks, including myself, have been wearing them for about three and a half weeks. We were supposed to wear them two weeks, but we decided to wear them a little longer because the information was so interesting. Well, you sleep well. We learned that. You exercise. We know that. You eat pretty healthfully as well, don't you? Where do you need to work? Well, you know, I'm finding out that uh, on, on certain days when I know I'm going to be at my desk a lot, if I just get up and do that little walk with the dog, the dog's happier, I'm happier. And a walk is 4,000 steps, a 30-minute walk. That mm -hmm. surprised me. Mm -hmm. And so, like Nancy, she just gets up off her desk more often. I mean, 15,000 steps that she had that day, that's phenomenal. So we said, I guess if we're ever looking for Nancy, we just need to start wandering the halls. Hall. <laughs> She's yeah. here somewhere. But 500 calories sleeping, mm -hmm. that's wonderful, too. So should I get up early and maybe work out, or maybe I should just sleep a little longer? And in those Guess what? I'm going to sleep a little longer. <laughs> yeah, go with that. By the way, other companies make this type of Absolutely. item? Absolutely, yes. I, we, do, we do understand there's a number of companies that make them around the same price point. We just found this one because Chris had it on, and Chris, of course, helps us out with lots of different fitness stories, and she is addicted to it. I want to mm -hmm. see how many calories she burns in a day. That yes. woman is unbelievable. unbelievable. Yeah. So, good information. Well, well thanks. You know, that was fun. Yeah, yeah really cool. interesting. Jeff Olson did a great job. You know,